Alright, well, there have been some questions on how I mount my fish finder on my feel free lure. 11.5. So, I'm going to show you. Basically, stay tuned in a future video to show how I built this. But, right here is the PVC mount for the transducer. Transducer wire comes out the side of it. And as you can see, it's solid in there. Transducer wire I run down through the seat. Underneath the seat, right down here, it runs into my hatch. In my hatch, I have the fish finder. A little bit of water debris. Water spots. I have my fish finder. And here's the transducer cable. And I keep all the wire hidden there for easy storage. In here, I have my battery box. Inside, I have my power cable goes to my fish finder and I just stick that back in the hatch slide back and then I got power to go to the fish finder now I've got just the Humminger, Humminbird 180 I didn't want nothing really fancy just something to help me identify cover so then I take and wrap the drink holder bungee around the unit like that and as you can see it stays there without really a problem let's go like this yeah I think oh, I think this will work out better ah, there nice and solid then it's just all plug and play and voila we're good to go so a beautiful day out here it's a little chilly so yeah I'm gonna put on my hoodie and uh, locate some bass and get some fish in the kayak. If you've watched a lot of my videos, then you'll see right there's where I catch all my shiners. But the bass don't hit the shiners in this pond for some reason. I've tried a lot and no luck the damn soft shell turtles sure do hit them though well let's get this thing on the water Ugh. I'm sailing away <laughs> Alrighty then Look at how clear that water is It just blows my mind The clarity of it Alright, seats all the way up <laughs> 
as you can see fish binder is kicking in before I get too crazy in my paddling well there's a fish at two foot <laughs> That's probably a catfish. But I want to go through some of these settings here. And... Run in 15 feet of water. No, let's do 30. And 0 zoom. We're gonna go auto. Chart speed 5. Fish alarm. Depth alarm is off. Filter is on. Set up. <laughs> I want it to warn you when it gets down to ten and a half. Okay. There we go. And the way I got it set up, it doesn't, it wiggles around, but it's solid. You're not going to knock it around, and it comes off easy. No screwing <coughs> or anything such. So, let's push off and... See what we can scrounge up. 